Hi, welcome to uh, Math 98. Uh, my name is Chuck Tabanji. I'm going to be your instructor for this online course. And um, I just want to do a quick little intro of me of the course and just get you a good idea of, um, of getting started on things. So uh, this is WAMAP. Like I said, my name is Chuck Tabanji. I've been an adjunct uh, faculty member here at Wacom for um, about 25 years. Uh, I also teach locally in the Millenham School District, teach math. So all math all day for me. It's good, it's good stuff. Um, so this is this is WAMAP. I use it because it's really robust. It's actually a, a, a super good tool. Enables us to kind of write math back and forth to each other. Gives you really quick feedback on, on tests and quizzes. I, I like it for that. So as you can see, you when you look, I'm looking at the student view right now, you'll see these, which will come up later. Uh, announcements are here. So you've probably already seen some of this because that's how you got to this video. The announcements will come out weekly and it's laid out by weeks. So if I look at week one, um, you are probably already doing day one tasks, already watching this video, you must be, um, that sort of thing. So uh, weeks are laid out. Each of these are a section, uh, 6.5, 6.6. There's a lecture that has a video. You get to hear me talk more. And then there's problems to do out of the textbook. Each week, too, there'll be quizzes and forums to do uh, there on here, and they're, they're pretty self-explanatory. Um, so announcements, check them right away. Look at your weeks, that sort of thing. This, this course is laid out, um, so just so you know, like I have everything uh, laid out and ready for us to go. Uh, I'll try to re release stuff about two weeks uh, before they do, so you can work ahead if you want to work out, uh, work, work ahead. So we do have quizzes, we have forums. That sort of thing all of that is in the syllabus which if you look in resources it's right here um, there's a form where you can do questions to the class here's a link to our textbook the class calendar is right here it's printable it is great uh, print it out and you will never miss a deadline well and refer to it and you will never uh, ever miss a deadline and just so you know the structure of these uh, the 6.1 6.7 that is the lecture that you should be looking at at that day. And then if something's italicized, it's due that day. So week one forum is due. Uh, we have some day one tasks that are due. Um, we have, you have a time quiz or practice quiz by the end of the, of the week as well. Uh, if you ever want to message me, you can send me a message. Uh, messages, you send a new message, you would find me and send it to me, whatever the topic. The thing I like about messages is you can type in math. So if you go to add new math, if I wanted to say, I was trying to do X plus Y squared. And if you arrow out of that, it'll format it that way. It gives us a really good opportunity to communicate with each other uh, math-wise. All right, let's take a quick look at the syllabus, which you can read, of course. Um, but on the syllabus, there's lots of good information about how things are graded, that sort of thing. Um, I just want to point out a couple of things. If you're going to contact me, you know, just send me an email, uh, a message me in WAMAP. Grading scale. So a couple things, exams in the final. Um, exam one, exam two, and the final are all online assessments. So the day of them, the test will be open from 8 to 10 p.m. And you get uh, two hours to get it done. Uh, it is timed, and it's a continuous sitting. So once you, um, once you hit start, the clock starts at the end of that time, the, class, uh, the, the assessment closes. So make sure if you want to get full your full time, start well before 10 p.m. because at 10 p.m. it'll close no matter where you started it. Um, you do get late passes in here. Late passes can be used on practice quizzes and time quizzes. They cannot be used on assessments, on exams, and they cannot be used on forums. So practice quizzes and forums, these are 15% of the grade. They're, they're linked together. On forums, you post and you respond to someone else's post. On practice quizzes, uh, you get as much time as you want. You get four tries on every problem. They just got to be done by 11:59 the day that they're due. You can always improve. 
Um, practice quizzes are a lot like the time quizzes. So if you've been doing the practice quiz and you're feeling good on it, you'll do great on the time quiz. Uh, time quiz is also two hours. Um, you get three attempts on each problem. It's really like just to help you feel solid about what we're doing. Uh, one important note I wanna make, this class ends at the final. All work must be submitted by 11.59 the day before the final. Late passes will not extend it. That's when the class ends, it's done right then. Uh, you get six late passes. They extend it uh, a long time, so use them if you want them. Um, again, they can use, be used on practice quizzes and time quizzes, not on exams, not on the final, not on forums. And there's a bunch of other stuff in here uh, that for you to take a look at. One thing I wanna point out is uh, the quizzes have an auto grader. I will always go through and look at your work. Your initial uh, grade that you get on stuff might not be accurate. I might go back and add some points. You know, the auto graders are not perfect. Um, and on exams, this is where the exam will be. Um, when you take an exam, if you scratch paper, take pictures of it, write the end of the exam and send them to me so that I can get you some partial credit on stuff. Uh, there's a thing in here about typing math symbols into WAMAP. Take a peek at that. Um, again, this is ways that you can write to me in math. I showed you an example of that in messages when we were looking at just my mail. All right. Uh, also, print out that calendar, like I said, in resources. It's huge. It shows you where everything's due. It shows you where all the tests are. Um, you might need to know that information for the first quiz that we have. And uh, also, this calendar here, I've tried to populate it. Um, it should be pretty accurate, but I would rely on, on um, this printable class calendar more than the other one. All right. Hey, my job is to make sure that you know what you need to know in order to be successful in this course, help you meet your goals. So please message me with questions, post a lot in the forum, and uh, I'm looking forward to working with you.